Hey, hello everyone and welcome in a new video in this video number eight about the ELK stack. I want to show you how we can process uh, multiple uh, type of logs with Fibit and how we can process, uh, process uh, these logs with Logstash to send it in uh, multiple uh, multiple Elasticsearch indices. So uh, to do it, we just reuse our uh, ELK stack in uh, the left side, left uh, terminal. We have our uh, Logstash, Kibana and Elasticsearch, our ELK stack and in the right side in the right terminal on elastic 2 we have just uh, uh, our uh, phi bit and uh, we have docker and we want to collect uh, the docker uh, logs and uh, uh, we want to collect uh, sys logs to send it to our log stash and to process it so to to start uh, I just, you can find the link in the video description if you want to uh, reuse uh, the same files. So we have only two files. Uh, we just use, uh, for beginning, we use the five bit. I copy uh, the two types. Uh, we have the type container, like in the previous video, to, to collect uh, the varlib docker uh, containers logs and the syslog. So I copy it. I go on my server in uh, uh, slash etc 5 bit 5 bit dot yaml. I remove all what we have on uh, our 5 bit input. I paste it. So what we do, uh, we create a first block for our container type with a path, uh, like in previous video, in slash varlib docker containers star star uh, dot log to collect all the logs about docker. And we add a tags. A tags uh, tags each line of our logs um, to, to send it in uh, Logstash and we'll see it uh, later but with Logstash we pass uh, our logs to uh, split uh, our logs in two types docker types docker tags and syslog tags and uh, with this split we just send uh, docker logs in a specific indices in specific index uh, about Elasticsearch index and uh, syslogs in another uh, specific uh, Elasticsearch index. Um, we have a second type with syslog. We use the protocol UDP and uh, we just uh, want to collect the local host log on uh, port uh, 514 uh, with UDP. This is uh, how we can collect uh, the log about uh, our local syslog. So I save it. Before we need to activate uh, the 5 bit module about syslog, local syslog, uh, so we just uh, like we uh, already have already seen in a previous video, we use 5 bit modules command line. We uh, want to enable and we so before we can see in slash etc 5 bit modules list of our uh, modules of course and in this module we have system modules and in this uh, in this uh, system uh, module we have uh, the collect about syslog enabled to true of course so and we have the collect about auth we keep all uh, all the the collect uh, auth and the syslog okay and we use the 5-bit command line, 5-bit modules and uh, enable and the name of our module system, system. yes we enable it um, so we just check 
testing. Uh, where 5 bit uh, send is data. Uh, yes, uh, we we don't want to send our data uh, directly to Elasticsearch, but we want to process our data to split it and to send it in uh, 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 distinct uh, indices, uh, Elasticsearch indices. To do it, we need to send our log uh, to f from 5-bit to Logstash because uh, we use Logstash to process our data. So we activate and command the line about Logstash. We use uh, our IP about Elastic One. So this is uh, this IP. Yes. Um, we just uh, before to restart it, we uh, change our logstash uh, configuration. To do it, we use uh, slash it. We want to edit uh, slash etc logstash um, conf d, and uh, we can edit. Uh, we keep the the old file, or oh, we can uh, remove this file. Okay, and uh, we can edit at the same place a uh, new file name uh, multi, for example, for multi source. And here we go we, in the second file name, named the multi bits. Here, yes. I copy all the line. Yes. Uh, I copy it and we will see it what we have in this configuration. Okay, so what we have? We have a first part about our uh, multi.conf. In this first part, what we do, we just uh, need to set an input. The type of our input is a bit because we use 5 bit uh, like uh, a source. We listen on port uh, 5044. And we have a second block, very important the filter block. We'll see it uh, later uh, in uh, details, but we don't need to understand exactly what we do. We set a first part when we want to. Uh, First of all, we uh, check uh, if a line of log is a line about uh, syslog. So to do it, we use a filter on fill set name. Fill set name is the type of the file bit, and uh, the type of our file bit is syslog. So we apply on uh, if we are on the type uh, syslog, we apply a grok, like in a Previous video, we reuse uh, uh, Grok. We see it later, but uh, we can use uh, a tool. Uh, a tool uh, who can help, help us uh, to define uh, the Grok for uh, the syslog uh, log and uh, to pass uh, all the line. Uh, we reuse it. We add the mutate and mutate is very important. If we need to understand uh, something about uh, uh, each line, we just want to uh, think uh, to uh, add a condition about a syslog. And if we are with a syslog uh, line, we add a tag named syslog because if we check our 5-bit configuration, we can see for container logs, we can add directly with 5-bit a tag named Docker, but with syslog, we can't do it. Okay. So we want to filter to, to filter and to split our log for we with uh, syslog one part and uh, in other part uh, docker and to do it we do it with uh, tags and uh, to do to do it 
we just need to add when we are with syslog a tag named syslog and for container we have already uh, a tag named uh, docker so that's all we pass our uh, container logs of course to split uh, il, uh, each um, each uh, element of logs uh, in, a, in a field and finally what we do we use an output and with uh, this output we send of course all our line in uh, an, uh, an elastic search indices index and we have two indices uh, one index about syslog and one index about docker we split it on the tags if we have a tag uh, named syslogs or contain contained uh, syslogs we uh, use an output type uh, elastic search on local host but the index uh, prefix is syslogs and for docker if we have docker uh, contains in tags we use the same uh, the same output but we change uh, the and index uh, prefix to docker so i save it i restart our logstash systemctl restart restart logstash okay take few seconds and after it what we do we restart our 5-bit systemctl systemctl restart 5-bit okay um, to test it we need to have a container if i check sudo docker ps uh, we have no container i run a container and the uh, docker run this log uh, already uh, run of course because uh, we have uh, at any time uh, 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 logs uh, with uh, with uh, with uh, our syslog when we restart a service we have a log when we uh, when the system do something uh, we have uh, potentially a log and uh, we do a sudo docker run uh, dash t dash dash name uh, c1 for container one we redirect and expose a port on 8080 for the port uh, 80 of our container we use the uh, engines okay and now what we do we do a curl to to send a request on our engines about uh, elastic 2 a curl on elastic elastic 2 on port 8080 okay i can send many uh, requests like here uh, we can go on our uh, elastic uh, on our kibana if we go on uh, the left column uh, we have uh, management and in stack management we can uh, go in index management and now what we have we have two indices one uh, index about docker and another index about syslog okay uh, if you want we can uh, go in index pattern we can create a new index pattern and uh, we can index pattern for syslog like here next we have a timestamp create an index pattern uh, we can create uh, another index pattern about docker the docker index okay we use a timestamp of course and we want to create it okay i go in al analytics uh, section and discover i want to use a discover uh, and i check the docker logs what we have we have uh, some logs about docker if i check we have our request 
and uh, the engine line. Uh, I think uh, we have it. Uh, where it is? Uh, many lines. We have an engine, of course. A container image engine. The name of our container, C1. Uh, on which server? Elastic2. Where is our message? Um, name version. Uh, uh, so maybe I can see it. I don't know. We have our tags, of course. Yes, we have our tag Docker. Very important because we use it to split our logs and uh, send uh, this line in uh, the Docker index of Elasticsearch. So I don't see uh, the message. I don't know where is our message, but we have it. Um, I don't know where, but we have it. So we can check the syslog. And in syslog, we have many, uh, we have many lines, of course, because uh, syslog is more verbose. Uh, we can take uh, one of, of, of our logs, the first, for example, which uh, server elastic 2 and uh, maybe what we have system module which uh, which module system because we reuse the module of five bit uh, which name of file set this is uh, like here when we go in our uh, log stash configuration we use uh, file set name this log we see it here, the host name, mm, the version, the path of our logs, var log, syslog, mm, which uh, other element? Yes, uh, no, uh, no, it's not the message. Syslog message, what we have, it's just SDA add missing path. So we have many messages. Uh, each 30 seconds, we have uh, 50, 50 documents, so 50 lines of logs. This is very, very important. That's all for today. Thank you for following this video. Uh, I hope uh, you like it. And uh, I see you in the next video. Bye.